Hello everyone, Flying the Cheer, welcome back to the United Netherlands, where we just took Badai down and we are colonizing Central Africa over here before France takes everything. We are at war with three people, with France, with um, two watts this state, but they will say, uh, okay, you won soon. And we are also with Papua in a war and we lose a lot of money, mostly because we use 300,000 goods for our military buildings. Yes, war is very expensive. Uh, we need to watch out for France because they took a little bit of land over here. I can white piece them out, but for now we are still winning. So I will keep fighting because we would like to um, humiliate France. And if we can, we should. Now Prussia hates me. We are also infamous now. So much infamy. Uh, what is this? Gold fields depleted. Unfortunate. We always click the same options. Lost another battle here. But they are soon at minus 100. Okay, Tuat is ours. Good. Papua's should go quickly as well. Yes, we are winning everywhere. Look, this will all be Dutch very soon. And then hopefully we can piece out the French war and finally make some money again. Because it's not going that great. And we, I, I have a lot of taxations right now. What is this battle? Yeah, Great Britain is trying to beat the French, which is not a good idea. Okay, we are getting there. We are almost at minus uh, 100. And then we will uh, humiliate France. It's a pity that we lost Prussia. But, uh, yeah. Shit happens. <laughs> oh, I could have taken this colony. French Guiana. Hmm... But yeah, you can't change that anymore. There we go. Humiliate France. France is out of the equation. And we just need to wait for Papua. And then we can finally be at peace again and make money. And start building some buildings. I'm not going to take a look at this until the moment we are out of the war. Because things are going to change. But yeah, we have a big army if we need to go to war. That's for sure. Yeah, you can't select colonies when you are at war, that's true. But we are colonizing in Congo. Congo headquarters. People in Flanders are going to migrate away and the, the Kyrgyz are going to Flanders. Yeah, of course. Still lowering my relations with the Dutch East Indies, so we can maybe uh, annex them. Uh, this should be over soon, right? Hurry up! I want to be out of this war. <laughs> yeah, their war support is going down like crazy. And the peace deal will be up on us. Good, then we are finally at peace and we can get rid of our deficit. There we go, Papa is done and we are making money again. Lucky us. Um, to keep all of that I think. And look at this, Papua is now part of the United Netherlands. There are absolutely no buildings here, really. And over here, also nothing. Well, it is Dutch now. Looking good over here. We are still not making a lot of money. I think that is because I'm not making buildings. States in turmoil, don't care, I don't care. We need more iron. 
Yes, because we lost our trade routes, isn't it? Should make our own iron. Steel is not made because we don't have iron. Well, we just need more iron. And we need a lot of it. Go to 12 in Bologna. Go. Would love to uh, tax you a bit less. Let's do it like this and slowly get rid of our deficit. It's going to take a while. An active trade route. Yeah, we are not friends with you anymore, so go away. I guess we will be friends with Great Britain. Over the long term. Well, we still have an alliance, apparently. How does that even work? <laughs> we have hostile relations. But we do have an alliance. No idea. It sounds weird to me. Now what I also can do is just pause the video until something happens and then just continue the video. Because the game is go just going so slow on the computer. Look how slow it goes. And I don't know why. It's not my computer, it's just the game that is not optimized. It's horrible. Because lowest graphics also don't do anything. Unbelievable. Waiting for a nice game and then you get this again. Ugh. I'm running on an i7-7700. I have 16 gigabytes of RAMs. I have a uh, GTX 1070 video card, which is still okay. So yeah, I don't know what I should do about all of this. The game is on an SSD as well. So... Yes, we will come in work. Come over here. Get that iron. More people get employed and I get more taxes. Very nice to see. Floating harbor. It's in the Dutch Shelbys. Yeah, let's just upgrade this as well. We need all the iron anyway. Slowly getting rid of our deficit over here. But yeah, then we need all of this. We also need more explosions. Yeah, the Men of Wars we can't do anything about because that is just because uh, people are importing it from us. Glass is expensive as well. Again. The one in Friesland is doing normal glass. Schelra is doing the porcelain. Get a bit more porcelain. And let's put four levels of glass making in the queue. Oh, we need so much electricity, it's just insane. But I, Chad, and Mali needs transportation. Give them a railroad. And let the infamy tick down because we are way too infamous. 
We are number four in the world, so we are ahead of Prussia. We just need to beat Austria, France and Great Britain. And Prussia is also going to uh, improve relations with me, so that's uh, good news. Yeah, opium. So you want even more opium? Right. Over there, they are just gonna make opium and nothing else. <laughs> okay, that's going to fix the economy. Yeah. Now you're not making any money anymore. Ooh, then we should not make more of these stuff. Iron is now too. Uh... We don't need this that much over here. Go away. Go back to nine. Still have too much iron. People are not making a productivity here. Now they do. A little bit. Right. You are still very profitable, of course. I would love to do this one. I'm gonna do it. We need more electricity. And we don't need extra. We need more of this. So three more. We need our technology and then we will have all the power in the world. And then we can upgrade all our textile industries, our furniture industries. They're going to get sawmills and stuff. It's just really good. Are the industrialists not unhappy with me anymore? No. Is this the time to go? Where is it? To this one? They're gonna get radicalized. I think I have most of the things that I want. Yeah. Just this one we can change. Hey, the pump jacks. Now that is interesting uh, for our plantations. We have now pump jacks. And... So we can go to automatic irrigation. We make way more coffee, but guess what we need for it? Engines. We need so much engines. It's insane how much engines you need. Guess when we get more? When we can use electricity. We really need, need to do this. We need to change our motor industries to uh, the next level. And then we can put everything at a higher efficiency. How's our GDP doing? It's still going up. Literacy is okay. We are number five in the world. We do have some radicals, but we also have a lot of loyalists. So people are somewhat happy in our country, except for the rural folk. <laughs> Which, in my opinion, is still weird. <laughs> the, the rural folk are not happy with you. Oh. Well. Do we have a problem then? No, not really. They can't do anything. Oh, okay. Houseware plastics. Yeah, then, we, then we need to start getting oil. We have a lot of trade I wish you could sort on what you started to import. So you can take a look at it. I'm not going to uh, zoom in like this the whole time. Because then the game goes super slow. If I'm here, it goes a little bit quicker. So <laughs> I'm going to keep my screen on the overview most of the time. Can we stop taxing so much? Eh, I prefer to tax more and just pay normal wages. Yeah. Could use my uh, points over here. To get a bit more money. I mean, that is just too good. Yay! Uprising! 
We can colonize more soon. You have to like this. Okay, we have 40 uh, flotillas now in the na in the navy. Still not enough to do anything against France, for example. We are coming to Flanders. Opium still expensive, we are working on it. Glass, we are working on it. Not that it really helps. Okay, let's get a couple more levels. And we have elections again. Alrighty then. So yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry about the speed, guys. I wish I could speed it up. I really do. Because we are just halfway, so... And I want to finish a game. And I will do it with my Netherlands. It's gonna take more time. So when we take Dar Al Kuti, we can colonize uh, Banga, Azende and uh, Bobangi. Maybe we can take all of this before France takes it. And maybe we can take a bit more over there. Another uprising. Great. We are colonizing very quickly. The Tripolitania is part of Ottomans, I think. So we don't want to take that one. Tunis then. Oh. Yeah, that's not good. Morocco is, is having a pact with France. So that's going to be it for there. We just have to focus on more natives here. Like Sokoto, Oyo. Get another port here. Because if we lose this port, this is all uh, lost really. This is the only port where people go through. <laughs> Which is really weird. Right, war started. Should be able to take this fairly quickly. Yeah, poink. Oof. I hope you guys are arriving soon. Yes, they arrived, so we will be there in time. No one is going to help them. And I like that we have this big chunk of Africa. It's uh, really good, actually. Oh yeah, I can't wait for this technology. This is going to be fantastic. More electricity. Oh, that's not good. We need even more bureaucracy. Pops the opium in. Oh, opium is no longer that much in demand, so we have to stop this. Yeah, otherwise you're not going to make enough money. So we have all the opium we need for now. Not if I change my uh, my military, but I won't. More power plants coming in, so more engine stations. The Patriotic Party can get momentum. No! Oh yes, that's better. We want to have the armed forces less influential. The war has broken out, so we're gonna take that state. And the Dutch will colonize more and more. We can have more interests. Uh, well, let's put one there. What about Japan? Mm. Let's get one with America. Maybe with Spain? No. Okay, let's put someone Africa here. Africa is Dutch. Well, not really, but that's what I would like to have. Do 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 do, and the technology is almost ours.
We make so much minting money from our gold fields. It's just insane. Uh, no, sorry, United States. Well, I could have accepted it, maybe, but... Meh. Government is super expensive. We have another native uprising. In Nama. I wish where that was. If I knew where that was, I mean. Where are you? Oh! Fantastic. More colonies. And the elections are in, who won? Yeah, just the same. I just keep everyone in. The government. There we go. Now we can colonize this, this, and this. Wait, I could click it while I was at war? That should not be an option. Well, I'm colonizing it now. See what we can get. I'm coming for you, Oranje and Transvaal. I'm coming for you, the Dutch Boers. Don't you worry. What about Zulu? Are there any farmers here? Don't th I don't think so, really. Cultures, no. Transvaal is... A couple of Boers, 2.76%. The most of them live in Oranje. Together with the Soto. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We're gonna make 500 more electricity. Does that mean I still don't have enough? I want this. I need to keep checking my buildings. Uh, where is it? Uh, oh no, these ones are okay. Do we need more rail transportation? Yes, let's just put everything on rail. I do have some things here. Oh yeah, the electric sawmill. We can actually use this. I think. We also need hardwood. Steam donkey and rail transportation. And we can now put the textile mill on electric sewing machine. But we need so much electricity for it and dyes, but I think I have to do this if I want to solve my clothing problem. Let's not pause the game, see what happens to our income. It should go down. I think, unless everything gets balanced next uh, week. Uh, no, it's okay, I guess. And our clothes are now doing very well. We can use even more electricity to make them more profitable. Let's do that. Can I do something like this? Just put everything on the same. Yeah, that's not efficient, so let's not do this. I will put everything on non-luxury clothes, and then maybe over here I will build the luxury clothes. I need a little bit more standards. There we go. Yeah, and then the glass works are doing their thing. I don't have to ch look at it. And then where are my Wasn't the one that I needed to do the furniture thing? 
No, apparently not. Oh, we have almost the most possible things here, so... Just need to make a bit more furniture then. Just a little bit. That is going to be okay. Oh yeah, and this one. Yeah, let's put it on. Oh, I can get so much more surfaces, but I don't need it. Oh, let's not do it then. All right. And now we need to uh, solve... Oh, we have, we have something over here. Oh yeah, we can put the automatic irrigation on now. This is going to cost us a lot of electricity. More coffee. And engines as well. Oh, only engines. Yeah, well, I want it anyway. Just need to solve my engine deficit. My economy can take this for a while. I think. <laughs> I think. Not sure. Alright. So we do have our... Uh, uh, um, Oh, ele electricity bonuses, and what I need for my engine works was... Electric railways. Now, that becomes very, very important. So, let's go to electric railways. It takes four years, but... Let's take it. Six in GDP. It's going all right. I am making more power. I am making more motor industries, and we need so much more than this. Good thing is, when I get this one, we will get more engines. We'll need more steel. There's the war. With this colony, then we can go to Tswana and we can colonize this region. Which is going to be fantastic. The United Netherlands is going to grow in Africa. We will have the biggest share. Well, France is having a big ch chunk as well. Okay, we have this part now. And this way I just fix my economy, just by uh, putting everything to the maximum, uh, the best and efficient way to produce stuff and then fix the economy. That's how I like to do it. Okay, looking good. More coal needed as well. My very good working coal mines. The diesel pump is the last upgrade for them. Let's get four more levels. And you can see what my economy is doing. When all of this is over. It's just insane. What's my infamy doing? Still way too high. You could give him a promotion or not. Oh. We did lose the bonus. We are really close to getting it again. Steel and glass working on it. Uh, we can still get more over here. We lost our Admiral, apparently. Do we have a really good naval commander? We only have plus 10 and plus 10. That is okay. And you also an explorer. 
I will get you. And when you are an explorer, does that mean that when I go for the Congo River expedition? We have no interest in Congo. Oh. Then I think that one will give a bonus. So we can finally complete that one. Alright, our economy is fixed again. Good. Oh, and another uprising in Bangala. Just when we finish this, so we can now colonize this and this. And we are having a new uprising. We are so lucky. Because we are going to take all of Africa super quick. Without getting infamy. Need a bit more lead. We are number four right now. Yeah, it takes a while before we take uh, Austria. Russia is not that far behind us, so we need to watch out for Russia taking us over. As long as no one is going to help them, we can just take all the colonies. What a border gore, right? My goodness. It's just horrible. <laughs> All of Africa will be colonized soon. It's 1880 right now. The game goes to 1936. So we have uh, 56 years to go. And we are 44 years in the game. Hang hand cranked machine guns. Right. And we have another uprising. In Herero. Perfect. Still would like indeed to take all of this. But the infamy goes down so slowly. Is it Bangala that we have uh, s a thing with? Yeah, so we can colonize everything around us. All these uh, states, Luba, Kuba and Yaka, the Congolese uh, states. We can colonize them all at once and then they all have a, a reason to uh, be angry with me. And then they can rise up and then I take it. So, and then they will not be unhappy because I don't uh, discriminate them. Steel, glass and tools. Opium is again expensive. Rubber as well actually. Um, where do I have all my rubber? In Achia. We'll put that a bit higher as well. Mali is not having enough market access yet. We could maybe destroy some buildings. But hey, they have a nice way to work here. Let's just add another railroad. And in Chad as well. There goes all the wars. Taking absolutely everything. I would say we have a good colonial rush as uh, the United Netherlands. We did it uh, correctly. Now, I think this is low enough uh, opinion to annex your uh, vassal. Where is it? Next subject.
no, not yet. We need to lower it even more, so let's do that. Now, this war will be over soon, and we can colonize everything. If this one is going to uh, rise up, we can colonize Matabele and Kirikaland. I think our GDP is just rising exponentially because we are having more building slots and we are just keep uh, improving everything. So many people have a job here now in the Netherlands. Can I see my uh, population? We still have a lot of peasants apparently. But we still have room to expand. Okay, Bang... Well, is done. We can colonize... This. Yeah, we lose the interest in Congo because we have a state there, I think. Now, come on, finish the war. Keep building and building. Alright, hurry up. Come on, I want to be at peace. I want to colonize every everything else. Yeah, just look how much we are colonizing. I love it. Now we took this. There were no buildings here. Okay. Our GDP per capita is number three worldwide. That's because because our peasants are still going into the into the factories, I think. So we just keep building and building and building. That means that for colonization, everything over here is done. The islands are no longer colonizable, I think. Hawaii is a rec Oh, we can maybe colonize Hawaii. No, they need to be, what, a decentralized power, right? Yeah, they are a unrecognized, but you need un decentralized. We can take uh, this tip of uh, Australia. <laughs> That's it, really. This is the last remaining colonies. That is why we need to rush it. Still need more engines. We are working on it. Oh yeah, this one. For more electricity. Yes, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do this. Not gonna do anything. I need electric engines. We are working on it, right? Yes, we need the electric railways for it. I still need to put my ships on the highest level. Uh, we could make less clippers and more steamers. Then we need to make ironclads in our shipyards. Then we need steamships. Oh, 
Oh, uh, let's do first aid. That's just way too expensive. <laughs> Colin is going fairly quickly. Split between seven colonies, yes. Russia not forming the North German Federation. Well, yeah, that's a bit annoying. It would have been nice if they did that, right? Everything is working on their highest sense, except for these... Uh... I don't make steamers yet. We can make oil. Where can we make oil? Here, let's start building oil. See what happens. Only the silk and the mice. And these special buildings. Yeah, electric industries we can still make. We can make telephones and we can make aeroplanes. For these we need oil. And rubber and lead. So telephones we will get in our country. Okay, I will end the episode here. In the next episode we continue. Um, I think from the next episode on I will pause the video at some point until something happens because otherwise it just takes way too long so thanks for watching and i see you in the next video bye bye